this pathetic planet from the face of the galaxy. The Force fights with me! Get on those gun turrets! Forces pull back. It is too late to retreat, Admiral. There is no escape for us. You are strong, child, but I will break you. I'll never fall to the dark side. This is but a taste of the dark side. of this again if you're catching this uh, live on Twitch uh, feel free to follow if you're catching this uh, at a later date on YouTube hit the subscribe button it's greatly appreciated uh, you know he, he's been kind of cramping my style a bit so I'm gonna leave him behind and just take off yep Kind of getting in my way lately. It's nice to have him for combat, but I'm hoping I'm not gonna run into any combat situations anytime in the immediate future, so. So what do I? What, what am I looking? I think we're gonna go with the party. I mean, after all, the name of this stream is we're gonna party with the Sith, like it's thirty-nine ninety-nine, BBY. overrun the lower city. Why don't the Sith go down there and restore order? Oh, yes. huh? What's this? Another off-worlder? I didn't realize how many of you there were on terraces of the Sith quarantine. What's going on? What is this planet coming to, huh? <laughs> Slummy's just walking around the upper city. Since you go to the lower city, you belong, Slummy. Yeah, like he said, these streets are for upper city citizens. <laughs> you better get out of the way if you know what's good for you. Oh, boy. Again, hoping not to get in any combat situations, but, uh, might be a little more. Uh, than come on, fellas. This lobby ain't worth the bother. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess you're right. Maybe next time, Slummy. <laughs> Come on, fellas, let's go. I heard the Sith are sending salvage teams down to the Undercity to recover those Republic escape pods. Listen to me, people. There is a terrible scourge sweeping our planet. Heed my warning before it is too late. 
The evil walks among us. Hey, I'm no alien lover, but I don't want to see them all killed. This kook's way out of line. If this crazy street creature keeps on about war and days of... The evil walks among us. With friends and fellow humans, I bring you a warning. A warning of a great plague spreading across our planet. Please, listen to me. My name is Gorton Kolu. Will you join my cause? <laughs> we must band together if we are to stop the spread of vermin and scum throughout Taris. I am speaking of the hideous-looking aliens who walk the world of Taris. The Wookies and Ithorians and Rodians and Bith, all of them! Listen, friend, for these are dark times. Xenophobic. That is why I, Gorton Kolu, have formed the Anti-Alien League. The Ugh. time has come for action. We cannot sit idly by while aliens blight our glorious planet. <sighs> you are like all the rest. You will not see the truth. On the day of reckoning, you will suffer with the rest of the alien lovers. As much as I'd like to be the dickhead here, I just a I can't go along with that nonsense. Us. Not even in a role-playing game. <laughs> I just, I can't fucking do it. Uh, droid shop, huh? Well, don't mind if I do. Kipuna, bona na kichu. Kim ba mule radwana, don kim ba no kunok nek, kava numpa kum pialia monokata, ranga kun bis kim no moruat, kakin cha na guana bokon. Genchopa chawi ti chok twiz yun kun, watu yama kama wuna henak nek, bugra shak kun ti chi wa um chawa, don abuk shami no nok, china pala mule, don ki ba non tontek. Tunni chachon kun ne mule brabast. Kin kun shi kan kachin awana wamata. Ni shi la chorga kin kun pala mona reji. Ching pala niska mule or tun rata tigin pot drunko. The searcha doma wana kondatama. Kuyami shu chikchita na patogta. Ya fulke gogala jiji. Ka wana bora atu gawa. Kan ki do ra kun watimi ala bola. You have my ear. Kakin cha na guat na bon con. Wana kumbes. Chi pala mulek. Tong ki pa na nonek. Tu nik ton chu chun ki nemolek rabest. Uf mala nibo kurk. Mona kachu. Kicha badwang. Wanga kum kiba bu mulera. Kakin cha na wagawa bakon. Tong ki ba nukunek, tanga bok sha um nak nong, mucha shakapaka, ye ki kun no ba mula draki chi chon. Tanga bok sha um nak nong, kin kun shin shin kin, ni kin kun na bule mule raji kun, chuni yun ni chi chi alduana, kava volpa muli kumana. I wonder how many I got. Seven computer spikes, two parts, one security spike. Should have got an infinite. God, they're expensive. Interesting. So about this droid you got. Jishawa. Jishawa. Tangabun shan. 
Tangabunshan Om Nong, Wangakun Beast Kin Ba Mula Rak, Choni Yun Tun Gigi Ida Dwana, Kava Vulpa Mulji Gumana. Yes, we've gone over that. Here, give me the T3H. Mulira on Shaturing Um Ni Patoga Wanga Chonzi Te Ika Krotu Hakuji Je Watu Yama Kama Wuna Henak Nek Hakuji Kopa Gino Mulara Kampiak Slimjo Puan Wanduana Tangabun Shan Om Nong Wanga Kun Beast Kin Ba Mulara Choni Yun Tun Gigi Ida Duana Kava Vulpa Mulji Gumana Tonga book sha um nak nong kin kun shin shin kin nikin kun na bule mule raji kun chuni yun ni chichi alduana kava volpa muli kumana kava dumpa kapalia monapata bona nakachu yin kin kun no ba mule rachi kun tong na bun sha nu yang china pala mule tong ki ba non tontek Tuni chachon kun mule brabast. Hachu a punky. Jishawa a nibun kasha chona si ichua yong bo joni. Mina mamba to mule ra. Haku gri kat gota la parabola. Kakin cha na guat na bon con. Wanakum best. Chi pala mulek. Tonki pa na nonek. Tu nik ton chu chun ke nemolek ra best. Uf mala ni bo kurk. China pala mule. Tonki pa non tontek. Tu ni cha chon kun ne mule ra best. Kipuna. Bona na kichu. Kin pa mule ra duana. Don kin pa no kudnok nek. Kava numpa kum pialia monokata. Ranga kun bis kin no moruat. Kakin cha na guana bo kon. Ni bajoni yo lak wish. Dopa yuma pasen lati non goto. Kenchopa chawi ti chok twis yun kun. Watu yama kama wuna henak nek. Bugra shak kun ti chi wa um chawa. Dong abuk shami no nok. Kipuna na bon sha. Kava dumpa kupaliaya mokai pata. Randi i chawa tongbola Johnny ku. Yuma wama nibo lora waisha waga shichi. Alright. Where's my droid? Uh, she's seriously. Worse than a fucking Jawa. Hey, lady. I thought I had my unscrupulous buddy to follow Randy me. What, what gives you? Bola, Johnny Ku. You ma wama nibo lora waisha waga shichi. Wanna check yomi? Wanna vota kunti tarakti? Chichin toma tunka cola yame joa. Na 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 kanki chiki nai potoka. Na wana pota. Kakin cha na guat na bon con. Wana kumbes. Chi pala mulek. Tonki pa na nonek. Tu nik ton chu chun ki nemolek ra best. Uf mala ni bo. Don't have to give me a refund. You said it in a money back guarantee. I think you should give me something next. Tonga book sha um nak nong. Kin kun shin shin kin. Nikin kun na bule mule raji kun. Chuni yun ni chichi alduana. Kava volpa muli kumana. China pala mule. Tonki ba non tontek. Tun ni cha chon kun ne mule brabast. Fuck no. We be getting out of this. Randi i chawa tombola Johnny ku. You ma wama nibo lora waisha waga shichi. Hachu a punky. No, I'm not back. I'm going. Piece of shit. Oh, I thought I had an unscrupulous friend to follow me around and help me. One that wasn't going to give a shit. But, uh. 
Clearly that wasn't the case. Oh, um. This elevator is off limits. Only Sith patrols and those with proper authorization are allowed into the lower city. It's obvious from the way you're dressed that you're not one of the Sith patrols. So unless you have the authorization papers, you must move along. Move along then. If the Sith wanted to get on everyone's good side, they'd go for... You ever seen a swoop bike? I've seen them at the races sometimes. They go fast and make lots of noise. I wonder what's up there. I'm sure there's something cool in there, but uh, I've really got no reason to be in there and alone. Just doesn't seem like a good idea. I hear there's a gang war between the hidden Bex and the Black Volkers. Uh, I heard the same thing. The evil walks among us. The enemy is here. We must act now before we are overrun with the vermin invaders. Huh. If the Sith cared anything about us, they'd stop that gang war in the lower city. Now that I got these assholes to myself. Nothing to say now, have we? <coughs> now, I wonder if any of those Republic space pods survived crash landing in the Undercity. Please, please don't hurt me. You don't have to kill me. I'll have Dabak's money if he if he just gives me a little more time. Please, I don't want to die. Here, I've got 50 credits on me. That's all I've got. It's yours. Just don't tell Dabak where I'm hiding, okay? I'm begging you. Hmm. Here, take the credits. But please, just don't tell Davik where I'm hiding. He'll kill me if he finds me. Largo is your what? name, huh? Tell me what. What do you want now? You're not going to tell Davik's bounty hunters where I'm hiding, are you? Just looking around? Just looking around. Oh, okay. Go ahead, look around. Just don't tell Davik I'm here, okay? What? No. But I already gave you all my money. I don't have anything left. You promised you wouldn't tell Davik where I was. That's too bad. Say hi you to can't him tell Davik where I'm hiding with a blaster bolt through your chest. Big fucking mistake, dude. That's the one, right there. Big mistake, dude. And he told me he was broke. Another 50 credits on him. There's a reason why people like you have a bounty on your fucking heads. Oh no, I got two bounties to collect. Holding out on me. 
Bad idea. Taurus used to be a nice place before the Sith showed up and started bossing us around. overrun the lower city. Why don't the Sith go down there and restore order? I don't think the Sith can fuck about water on your world. Hey, you made it. Hey, I was beginning to wonder if you were going to show. Party's in full swing. Come on in. You have to try this Teresian ale. It's fantastic. We should have conquered this planet ages ago. Careful, Sana. That wine's got quite the kick. A couple more bottles and we'll all be passed out on the floor. Who cares? We're not on duty tomorrow. Let's live a little. Come on, drink up. Come on, drink up. That's right, drink up. Perfect. you want and get out I remember when a person didn't have to worry about thieves rummaging through their home you ain't supposed to be here this ain't your home don't don't hurt my family look just take what you want and get out I mind if I do is you one of the Sith my daddy says the Sith are nothing but bullies you don't look like a bully mm, looks can be deceiving friend Is that it? I really don't know all there is to do in this place. Huh. I guess we have. But before I go to the lower city, I suppose I better get my, uh, goody two-shoed companion. Still too drunk to talk, huh? There's a swoop gang war in the lower city. They say you can get shot just for walking in the streets. What's this? Another off-worlder? I didn't realize how many of you there were on terrace. Another Sith quarantine. Hmm. 
Guess I did pick up some. Dude's giving me the silent treatment, wow. Well, my friend, we're... We're going to, uh... Go down to the lower portion of the city. Yes, what's on your mind? Yes, what's on your mind? <laughs> now he wants to talk. You got it. I'm just the janitor here. I don't know nothing that would be useful to you, Sith. Hachu apanki, jishawa anibun kasha chona si ichua byong bo joni mina mamato mune ra hapu gi katotan parabola. Raboda ni mukis matola tuk nan kongu na muri ra ra bes wana kum bes king na muri ra tuk king ba. Hachi <laughs> This creates an interesting situation. I might, I might play with this a bit here before we... What's going on? I didn't ask to come back in here. Kind of strange. But okay. This could be interesting. I'm not looking for any trouble with you, sis. Please, just leave me alone. Please, don't take me for question. I don't know any... Yes, what's going <sighs> on? You do? Well, fair enough. What do you want to discuss? You got the skills of an elite commando, and you saved my butt more than once. Between that and your facility with languages, I'm lucky you're here. But that doesn't mean that I'm gonna stop watching you being wary. I'm just not built that way. Period. You, uh, you haven't done anything yet. But there's no guarantee that you won't do anything in the future. I've been betrayed before by people, and I'm... Well, it won't happen. Yeah, well, you wouldn't be the first. Look, I don't expect you to be my friend. This is just the way I am. No need to take it personally. Me? I don't remember ever saying anything about a traitor. All I mean is that if you're smart, you won't trust anyone. Not me, not Bastila, and especially not yourself.
And I don't need all these questions. What I do need is to try and save the galaxy, if that's even possible. Why is whether or not I trust you or anyone so damned important to you? Why, why do you even care? We don't have time for this, so can we please just drop it for now? Can we pick it up later if you really must? I'm, I want to get underway. I want to make sure I don't get a blaster bolt in the back, asshole. I'm just standing here. I'm not looking for any trouble with you, sis. Please, just leave me alone. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You can't go into the cantina while you're on duty. Good. Get back to your patrol route. We need to keep a strong presence in the streets to maintain order here. Like there isn't a way around that. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't say anything in the description, but it's clear why I can't wear it. You got me. <sighs> oh, hello there. What can I do for you? Would you like to see my inventory? That is why you're here, isn't it? At least, I hope so. Questions? Oh, I, I, I don't know anything. Nothing you Sith would find interesting anyway. I'm just a simple shopkeeper. Of course, of course, right away. Boy, they don't open up at all. Thought oh, maybe get better prices? That's, uh... What's on your mind? You got it, you. Greetings and good day. I hope you're patrolling girls well today. All hail the Sith. Ha! <laughs> <sighs> oh, that's the look, huh? I'm not looking for any trouble with you, sis. Please, just... I'm not doing anything wrong. I I'm just standing here. Greetings and good day. I hope you're patrolling girls well today. All hail the Sith. Don't worry. If I hear anything, you, Sith, will be the first to know. For a price, of course. The Sith Governor said I could keep this medical facility open. I had the proper permits. Please, I don't want any trouble. Well, what do we have here? Looks like we have trouble. You only the Sith credit, Governor sir. said I could keep this. Damn it! I was hoping I could use this to extort him. Guess I'm thinking a little too much. Please don't take me for questioning. I, I don't know anything, I swear! <laughs> Ooh, hey, look at this! It's shit! <laughs> I'm so scared! <laughs> Careful. Don't do anything stupid. We don't have no trouble with the Sith. 
Oh, yeah. You're right. Sorry about this, shithy. Come on, fellas, let's go. <sighs> A plague! Greetings, my Sith friends. Rest assured, I have all the proper permits to be here, spreading my message. Feel free to stay and listen if you wish. You'll find my message most enlightening. Nope. Yes, bitch. Pudu, Tony Rama, Napraka, Donko, Tsercha, Chupapanki. Ni bajoni yo lap wish, dopa yuma pasen lapti non goto. Rundi i chawa tongbola joni ku, yuma wama nibo lora waisha waga shichi. Your sadness. Uh, still these problems are not really. Hmm. How much for him? Pudu, Tony Rama, Tony Rama, Shachika. I'm not looking for any trouble with you, Sis. Please, just leave me alone. Listen to me, people. There is a terrible scourge sweeping our planet. Heed my warning before it is too late. I think maybe keep my disguise up in the lower city and we'll keep people from fucking with me, maybe? Dumpa kunpa yia moka pata. Kanai kachu. Kinkin kuno ba muli rachi kun. Tong na punja nyonyang. Kamal pa muli kamana. Ichuka. Yun patisa. Inban chalora kun. There's a gang war going on down here. Kipona! Gava tumpa kulpa yia moka paata! Chiyoka ku tumpa kulpa yia! Interesting. You get the complete opposite of what I expected. Ah, uh, who are we looking at here? That one? Fine, fuck it, that one. I heard I Oh, that's how it's gonna be, alright. There's the defense bonus. Oh. Now where did we come from? Where did we go? There's a bad joke there. Lower city apartments, huh? Well, this sounds like a great place to start. I'm keeping my soda. 
No problem. Got it. Kipuna! Kava tumpa kulpa yiya moka paata! Fuck you gonna do about it? Kava tumpa kulpa yiya moka paata! Buna night kachu! Yin kin kuno ba muli rachi kun! Tong na bun shanyunyang! Kava volpa mulchi kamana! Uh, you think so? I think. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. Go away. Next. Remember to activate the holographic security system in the proper orders I open the door to go in. Just activate the holograms in the same order that they joined the band. Since you're the Twisted Rancor Trio's manager, you should be able to figure out the code. Chronicle, the amazing story of the Twisted Rancor Trio. found at the trio to earn a date with young singer named Belinda. The young ploy worked and Alinda became the first member of the band. Oh fuck, I have to pay attention to this shit now? Hang on a second.
Yes, what's on your mind? Oh, you want to argue some more, is that it? So I've seen. If I were Malik, I'd be a bit nervous to have you on my tail. I just don't trust easily, and for good reasons, which are my own. I suppose I won't get any rest until I talk, will I? You want to know why I don't trust anyone? Fine. Here goes. Five years ago, the Jedi had just finished the war with the Mandalorians. Revan and Malak were heroes. I was damn proud to have served in their fleet. It was completely unexpected when they turned on us, invading the Republic while we were still weak. Nobody knew what to think, least of all me. Our heroes had become brutal, conquering Sith, and we were all but helpless before them. I mean, think about it. If you can't even trust the best of the Jedi, who can you trust? It's not that. It's... That's not what I mean. There were, there were others. Good, solid, trusted men who joined them. Malak and Revan and the Sith deserve to die for what they've done. But the ones who fled the Republic and joined them are even worse. The dark side has nothing to do with why they joined with the Sith. They deserve no mercy. I know. I'm... and I should apologize to you. I've, I've become so accustomed to expecting the worst in others, and you've done nothing to deserve that. It's just... oh, never mind. Let's just continue with what we were doing. I'd rather not talk about it.
Ready. You ask for this. Yes? All right. Nobody playing. Chi gratulo da pograci onni un comba in tomo mutuba. Loda dita kun. Ida patiso batua kacha tu tong. Pograsha kun ti jaka um. Chuba kaha chopa chawa chwish yunku. Jodo jid bungaran tang. Ka chi kun ida hodonga. Ye king kun o ba mulera chi kun. I I might be. Takum just stuck Mickey, grab a mogo, catch you it up or dunga. Tolo bank, while a Uganda naru chuchut. Mogisha punga, bola wana chikne. Pamule slimo, poda da nanga, kum beast, mule rabes. Runda di hotunga, kun hunga bi. Wanna kun bez ching bala mule, tung king ba no. See what you got. Tuk ning chatu kun de mule rabes. Chetu ba do wana nidi bobo. Tung na bung sha no nunya. Tung patu kashmak talea. Kuyami juz chikata na patoga ya. Fulki koko gala jiji. Ka wana bot atagwa. Kagi dura te kun wata te mana iya bola. Interesting. Plus or minus six, plus or minus three. I'll definitely take the plus or minus. Those are a definite benefit. Plus or minus ones. Should kind of slow my roll here. All right. Thank you, friend. Greetings, stranger. My name is Gelroot. Are you a Pazak player by chance? It's so hard for me to find a match now that I've been banned from the Upper City Cantina. 
a simple misunderstanding. Some of the other Pazak players don't understand the finer points of the game. So what if I win 15 matches in a row? That doesn't mean I cheat. There's no justice. My lucky Pazak deck was confiscated and I was banned from the upper cantina. Since then, I've been desperate to find a match. I'm gonna smoke first, but we'll, we'll be talking here If you're here ever looking minute. for a match and you get tired of posturing in the upper can... Posture. <laughs> Let me get a drink quick, if I can. Um... Go away. Kipuna! Kava dumpa kupalea muka pata. Jiyoka kutumpa kupalea. One. Oscar, Two. Two. Mm, yep, I saw that coming. Three. Three. Idiots. Go away. One. <laughs> Two. Two. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. I wonder if I can handle taking him on, man. This is... <sighs> I, I gotta know if I can. Hey, Callow. That moment is sadly past. All right, where were we? Looking for a drink, right? Uh, I don't think it's. Oh boy. I told you to leave me alone. So give me some space, bug eye. Your breath smells like bantha poodoo. Kuyami juski chika nai. Kang patoga smak tilia. Da beast you bong kunki punk pa. Tongi tuama ji human ak un ikatune. Who you call a little girl, chuba face? Uba batu konchi. She's got a soki kupa bona na chachu. Just a sec, boys. Sawbar, a little help here? I need you to rip the legs off some insects. <laughs> Quit complaining. You can finish eating later. Besides, you need the exercise, so get over here. You got a problem with me? Then you got a problem with Big Z. So unless you want to take on my furry friend, I suggest you greenies hop on out of here. Chubasa! Kimba muli rab wana ji. Kaba vorpa murji guma ya. Her name is Mission. Place looks like a little bit more than I might have bargained for. I just look for a drink, huh? Yeah? Uh -huh. Of course, there's a hut. Why would? Is that?
We're gonna find out who that is. I think that might be Davik, so. We're gonna chill in here where I don't expect too much carnage to just, you know, unfold, and I'm gonna have a cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get out there to do that here for a hot minute, so. Smoke break it is. I'm gonna start some shit with those rhodians. Eh. Thinking that hut is David, so hopefully I'll have some credits coming my way to, to gamble with here. Got some new new cards for my deck that should be a little more helpful than just the regular old pluses with a plus and a minus. I knew how many cards were in the uh, in the drawing deck for a Pazak game. That'd be good to know. You know how many tens, ones, twos, all that fancy shit. First, I'm gonna mop the floor with old Gelrude here. Oh, I'm hoping. I'm hoping. And then when we get back up to the main city or the upper city. Start taking that fucker's credits. <coughs> Might have to buy some more cards. I don't know. We will see. About ten cards in the deck, and I pull four for my sideboard. So that's about. 40% of my deck I'm gonna see. I just bought four cards.
Back again. Well, ever since I was banned from the upper cantina, I've been desperate to find a good game of Bazak. You wanna play? Mm, you just found one, friend. Excellent. My funds were getting somewhat low. Maximum wage is 40. We're gonna go for it. Um, how do I remove cards? Those? Those? Stay low. And I'm getting fucked. Should have rethought this, maybe. Uh, no, can't afford to fuck around anymore. Fucker. Stay low. Stay low. Fuck. <sighs> Stay low. Stay low. Stay low. You did well in our last match, but I think your luck may be about to run out. <coughs> so do you want to play again? Excellent. Sure. My funds were getting somewhat low. The old double or nothing, huh? Ish, the side deck. Let's play more cautious. Stay low. Stay low. Yikes. Stay low, babe. Fuck. Nothing I can do about that. You're gonna fuck me this game, huh? Mm hmm. Here comes the bust. No. Yep. You played well in our last match. <laughs>
I think How you're cheating. How dare you accuse me of cheating? It's not my fault you lost. I'm just a good player with a strong deck. Maybe you just need more practice. Or maybe you need to buy some better cards. Go talk to Uriah over there. He can sell you some cards. Excellent. My fu- Get back that 40 and then I'll go buy some new cards. How's that for a plan, huh? Ooh, that's a nice draw. Natural, will you? Oh, I'm gonna let this one slide. Yeah, I'm gonna let it slide. Money back. It's becoming a losing endeavor. <laughs> Stay low. Stay low. Sucks. He stayed with that? I fuck. Oh my word. How was I to know he stayed with that? I'm gonna get fucking screwed. Played well in our last. If you're ever looking, uh, one of the many reasons for saving. I'm not accepting that shit. We're gonna do it again. Back again. Excellent. Hi.
Stay low. Alright, give me a natural, come on. Fucker. Fuck, I got screwed. Stay low. That's not low. I suppose it's low enough. Stay low. Stay low. 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 Oh, fuck my life. I have no choice. Stay low, come on. God damn it. God damn it. Fuck. <sighs> Bust. Fuck! He draws a natural. Come you played on. Well or... If you're ever looking. It's garbage. <laughs> I just need some better cards to fill out my deck. Is what I need. That's what's going on. Here. So let's. Back again. Excellent. Grind it out and get the cards, and this will work out a lot better. Fucking prick. Mm. Let me take it. How come he's always got the perfect card waiting? I had some nice cards, I ain't got the perfect ones. Fuck! Well, at least he's out of side cards, I guess. That makes it maybe a little easier. But he'll just draw naturals. I've already seen this before. They're all bust here. Stay low, come on. Damn it. Stay low. Come on, low. Hi. Oh. Fuck. Fuck. God damn it. You played well. If you're ever looking for a... I do think you're cheating, Gelrood. Ah, oh, I got one win out of him in every game since. Has been fucking trash. Back again. Excellent. And of course, it was the first one, too. Be a natural. <sighs> Fuck him. 
glad I didn't waste nothing. Let that slide. I'll take the first one and the first one only, right? Just that. <laughs> Fucker hits a natural. God, come on, seriously? How the fuck am I supposed to compete with that? I mean, it doesn't matter how your deck's built when they do shit like that. Now I'm completely at the mercy of his fucking cards. If you're ever looking for a man. Let's get one. Back again. Come on, man. You give me the first one the Action. first time. You won't give me one at all now. Can I just get one? All I want is one. And I'll go buy some more cards. Oh my god, heck. What a draw. <sighs> mm hmm Glad I didn't waste nothing on this. Give me a fucking natural, will ya? Of course you won't. scenario you know fucking naturally yeah of course he's got the perfect fucking card to do it too Days with 17, is it? Oh, he's drawing with that. Oh my. Of course. You played well or fucking screwed. Fucking if you're ever looking for a fucking Oh my god. Seriously. I mean, how is the same bullshit with the tutorial? It's the same bullshit with the guy upstairs, and even after Back again. my deck, it's the same bullshit with these guys. I'm lucky Action. if I can win one I game. And it's that advantage of me being forced to hit first every fucking time. They have the advantage of seeing what I get to do before they gotta decide how far they gotta push it. I mean, that's... Some real fucking trash. Oh, fucking then this draw. You a fucking natural? Oh, I'll take it. Let him burn that up. I, I, I'm not gonna catch it. 
Be a natural, will you? Of course he's got an answer for it. You're gonna stay with 18, are you? Be a natural. <sighs> Seriously? <laughs> I mean, it's a fucking joke. That's what it is. They'll draw naturals and I'll just draw shit all day. There's, yeah, e exactly. I, I called it right there. I'm drawing shit. He draws a perfect natural in three cards. Fucking joke. Now I can't even win one set. Forced to fucking lose all three right out the gate. Alright, get lucky. You fucking give me it. Stay low. God damn it. Yep, get fucked. You played well in our last match, but luck. Uh, if you're ever looking for. Back again. No, I'm If you're not. ever looking for. Back again. Fucking eat shit, dude. Excellent. It's an interesting draw. Really hate to waste it. Of course, he's got the perfect card to make fucking 20. I don't, but he will. Every fucking time. Let's stay with 18. Oh, of course you are. That's... <sighs> make me burn a card to tie one. I mean, it's just... Of course, he's got the perfect fucking card waiting for it. And I'm fucked. Yep, and I'm you fucked. Played well and I'm there it is. If you're ever looking for a man. Every fucking game. What is this? One out of ten? And it was the first one, right out the gate. Back again. Back again. Excellent. I f changed my strategy on this. He does. He, he just magically hits 25 and has the answer for it.
Hmm. No way this just happened. No way. Three you did straight. well in our last match, but I think your luck may be about to run. If you're ever looking for... I'm gonna go put those credits to good use. Excuse me a minute. You cool, cool. Infinite supply of these fuckers. I'm gonna send a lot straight up negative. Back again. Back again. Excellent. Hi. Forty credits, my friend. We're gonna restructure the deck again. Okay, I'll take a two-card natural. It's about time the luck works on my favor. I forgot. Of course, I forgot to save, right? Save early, save often. Is that the old saying? He's got it. Of course he's got it. He's just waiting to hit that perfect time. Yeah, I got one too, I guess. I can afford to stay on night. That equals a natural, huh? Suppose that's to be expected. Got no answer for that. You did well in our last match, but I think your luck may. If you're ever looking for a. Now we're gonna save again. And now we're gonna take him to the fucking cleaners, right? That's how this works. Back again. Excellent. My fuck. Your friends are about to get lower, friend. Stay low. Stay low. In this situation, what could he possibly draw that's going to beat a 19 the way I see this? 
or even an 18. Let's go for it. Stay low. Stay low. Let's stay with 18, easy. That's unfortunate. Let him take this one. That's better than the option I'm looking at. Give me a fucking natural, will ya? Now it's down to if I don't get burnt, I need a natural. Fuck. Here's where I get screwed. No! He's got an answer for it. Nick. <sighs> oh no. I saw that coming. You played well? If you're ever looking I, for him. Cheating, Gelrude. I don't think we're gonna go on quite the losing streak like we did though, so. Just give her another one. Need a cigarette. Back again. Excellent. Yeah, that's the side that we're using. Ooh, wow, yes, that's an interesting draw. Come out strong. Fuck him. Nice draw. Of course, he got the perfect answer for it. I'm not gonna waste two cards. But I'm gonna take this. Can you give me a fucking natural? You never will. Of course, he always draws right into that card. I'm gonna get fucked here. Yep. You played well in our last. Fucking saw that. If you're ever looking. Really? I'm gonna deal with this shit again? Back again. Excellent. Interesting draw. Hmm. Hey, wasting a card to tie a set. I don't want him getting off to an early start, though. Seems like an advantage in this game, which you wouldn't think it is, but it, it just it feels like it is. <sighs> it might stay on that 18 for some reason. It feels stupid, but yeah. Yay, natural 20. And it means nothing in the end. And get fucked.
Yeah, force him to make the decision. Why not? Oh my, and he draws right into his own 20. When do they not do that, like, every fucking time, huh? Fucked, man. Fucked. Just always one more. One more than it needs to be. If you're ever looking for Yukukumo Kuyamiju Back again. Back again. Excellent. Hi. Saved, shouldn't have. Oh well. That feels like a decent put together now. He <laughs> draws a fucking natural. God damn it, man. I'm just gonna get fucked like this, I swear. the mercy of the fucking cards and he's got two on the sideboard. Mm -hmm. There's no way I can pull naturals. N not the frequency they do. Of course. You played well? Right into played it. Well? How dare you? Or maybe you need... Excellent. One more, you motherfucker. I'm sick of you fucking robbing me like that when I forget to save. Yeah, yeah. Watch him find a way to make 22. I'll be damned. If you're ever looking, if you're ever looking, break even just so I can save again. I think I've seen a different way of looking at this. I'm almost thinking I should fill my fucking tank up. Back again. Excellent. I fuck. Hmm. 
That's kind of disgusting, but whatever. Nothing I can do. And this card's pretty useless. He's plus minus ones. I don't know. I might want to replace these. He fucking gets their natural. Come on. You did well in our last match. Oh, talk about lucky. If you're ever looking for. You kukumo. Kuyamiju. Back again. Back again. Excellent. Keep forgetting that fucking save. He's got the perfect answer for that. Give me a fucking 20, will ya? It's a 19, come on. Of course he does. Of course he fucking has that sitting there waiting. <sighs> Stay low. Stay low. Alright, let's see where he stands now. 19 is what he's hit on. Now it's best hand wins. Give me the fucking 20, will you? Hunt! Oh. You played well and I'm... 
Excellent. Stays with eighteen, he does, huh? Fucking twenty. You did well in our last match. If you're ever looking for even so I could save again. I think the deck's built better now. I should be able to start back again. The floor with them now, right? Excellent. Mm, that's unfortunate. that luck going, huh? Stays with 19. <clears throat> mm. I'll let that one slide. I hate to do that. But... Ah, it's like once you're on the busting end, it's like impossible to fucking avoid. plays right into whatever he hasn't got a chance to oh my god we're loading because you played well 
I hit the wrong if you're button, ever looking just get fucked. Try to get two games out of them, and then I need to say it. Back again. Excellent. Interesting. That was going to come at some point. <sighs> I give all that shit for free. Hardly waste. Worth wasting a card for the final result of the fucking hand. You did well in our last month. Excellent. Five. Give me your credits, dude. Uh, hello, you. Gonna stay with 18, are you? Fuck. I shouldn't even have burned one. I'll take that back as repayment for that. two games. I'm gonna go for a third. Press my luck a little bit. Give me your credits, sucker. Next 19 out of the deal. I'm, I'm not even gonna waste anything. You can have it. with 18, didn't you? Gelrude. You did well in our last match, but I think your luck may be about to run out. So do you right. want to play again? Not right now. I need a cigarette. <laughs> if you're ever looking for a match and you get tired of posturing in the upper cantina, just come down here and find me. I'll play you anytime. I keep pulling credits out of you, man. We'll be playing plenty of Pizak. I guarantee it. I need credits. I mean, who doesn't need credits? I just wonder at what point are they going to let me stop breaking, motherfuckers? He likes to have a lot of plus and minus fives in his deck, I've noticed. 
Of course, I got a lot of plus and minus high cards too, so I can't say I to play. I'm not sure how good the sound is on your guys' end, but I just heard a Rodian talking shit in the background.
Alright, let's see if we can't hustle some more credits out of Gelrood. Save early, save often, right? Back again. Excellent. Give me your credit, sucker. <sighs> of course he does. Stay low if we're gonna go that route. Stay low. Damn it. Uh-huh, of course. Oh, do I want to just hand him one? I afford to just hand him one. I don't want to take 18 and stand. Not this early. I'll hand him one. Fuck. Stay low. Stay low. Fuck. Of course, it walks right into that 15. Oh, now I'm hard on the fucking ropes. Draw it some kind of natural hand here. There's no way to win this otherwise. <sighs> yeah, fuck. You played well in our last. If you're ever looking for. Now, at least we lost right out the gate. I'm not gonna tolerate that shit. Not right out the gate. There's some bad draws. I think. Really bad. Draws. Back again. Excellent. I know how he was banned. He was banned for cheating. That's why I want to take his fucking credit so damn bad. Give me a natural. Come on. Oh, I'll take nine. The fucker draws natural 20, too. I hate being forced to draw first every fucking game, man. It is such a disadvantage. It's like playing against a fucking casino. <laughs> fucking hits a natural. My god. I'm just gonna be fucked again. I mean, even when I build a good deck, it's the same shit I dealt with earlier. I mean, what fucking garbage. You fucking settle for a 15 and risk busting again and waste a fucking card. And I'm at the mercy of drawn first. Give me a natural, will you? Oh my god. I'm fucked. There's no way he's not making better than 15. See? And that six would have screwed me, so I mean, there's well nothing I could have done about that. If you're ever looking for, why am I back to getting fucking screwed again? I don't understand. 
We built a good deck, didn't we? This being forced to fucking Back lead again. every again. fucking Back game is killing. It's the same house advantage that the fucking casino has when you play blackjack. Is you can bust your hand before they even have to touch theirs. I mean, yes, we hit at the same time, but again, I can bust before he gets there. He's got an answer for shit like that every fucking time. You give him that 15 and 16, he's got an answer for it every fucking time. Mm, that's kind of a thought process here. I want to think about my side deck a little more, because this is bad. Again, it's bad. I just got it three games in a row. Really. I don't understand how we're back to this shit again. He just you played well and I like smoked. If you're ever looking for a hey, hey, yeah. So we're gonna take the winnings and go back over and think about this side deck a little bit um, Is there a way I can back out of the game after back again. season two? Because I wanna look at what I got in Excellent. There. Hi. Plus negative three plus negative six is Plus negative three, and negative six, and negative four. I mean, to have answers for 14s, 15s, and 16s. Hmm. Played well in our last match. If you're ever looking for. You kukumo! Kuyami juice! Back again! Excellent. Thank <laughs> you. 
You did well in our last match, but I think your luck may be about to run job. out. So do you... Excellent. Come up one. Especially if he's gonna go draw fucking natural. Uh yeah, twenty nine is pretty tough to do anything about. Can I afford to be comfortable? Alright. He'll stay with the eighteen. Danger now if I hit twenty seven. He stays at nineteen. Yeah, twenty eight's too much. <laughs> of course, he's got an answer for that shit. myself. Fuck! You played well uh, I'm, I'm down one. Excellent. Alright, no more risky dumb shit like that. That was my mistake. 
play this smarter. right into a fucking 20. I need a natural. Well, I'll take that too, I guess. It always puts him within three, five, or fucking four on the other end, and it always sets him up. It's hard to argue, you know, like they said, that he was thrown out for cheating, because let's be honest here, um, it's the yellow cards that are setting him up, not his cards. He just happens to have the right cards to answer for. We're both pretty much down to needing some naturals now. to fucking stay out an 18 to beat a 15. Fuck! Now we're down. You played well I'm not going to accept running this if way. If you're ever looking to... That's insane, no matter what I do to my fucking deck, it still just isn't enough. You cool, cool, no. Cool, yeah, me, just. Fucking twenty. What do you do about that? Suppose you answer back the only way you can. Of course, he's got threes and fives all fucking day, and they always set him up with anywhere between three and five from that twenty. All day long they set him up like that. If you're ever looking from I mean, I don't get what the deal is here. I don't understand how, no matter how I build my deck, I still face the same bullshit every day. 
and it's the constant disadvantage of having to bust before he busts. Which is Going first, always, is a disadvantage. Back again. Back again. Excellent. Nice. Second bet more. Uh, let's see. Let's move that one. Honestly, this is just. Fifteens are good for him. I mean, I kind of play with the strange, same strategy on that. But try to be prepared for the fifteens and sixteens. The draw's a fucking natural. Of course, he walks right into it. Might as well let him have it, huh? Nah, I'm really up against the ropes. Of course it gives him a fucking natural. Why wouldn't it? Then I'm gonna get fucked. Just straight fucked. You played well and I'm I don't fucking understand. If you're ever looking for a map. No matter what I do to the deck, it's the same fucking shit. It's the same shit I dealt with upstairs. It's the same shit I deal with downstairs. It's the same Excellent. fucking nice. problem. This one is fucking useless. And there it is. I mean, it's that first, it's the opportunity to bust first. I mean, he doesn't even have to worry about busting if I get it first. It's fucking ridiculous. And the odds of me drawing consistent low cards to put him in the position of busting first is unlikely. It makes it easier for him to find a hand to stand on. I see a fundamental flaw with my deck I need to correct though. Well, in our last match, 
Excellent. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna try to fix this flaw. I'm up one, right? Uh, this is it too. I mean, I do want to replace this card, but I don't see anything worth replacing it with. Terrible draw. Odds of him doing better than a 19 is pretty fucking weak. Of course, 25 sets him up just like a 15 does. And 16 sets him up too. Fuck him, he can't keep pulling this shit. <clears throat> I need a fucking natural. Give it to me. Four on one end, six on the other one. Better off using it. You did well in our last match, but I'm up two. Excellent. I fuck. That is nasty. That's what I was hoping to see. Nine or less. Now I gotta play on the smart end of things. Fuck. Too risky to hit that now. He'll hit a natural. Boy, if I didn't fucking call that. He'll hit a 15 here. Nope. I'll be damned. Take that natural. You did well in our last match, but I Am I really up three? Excellent. Five. Let's see if we can go up four. Mmm, that's tasty. <laughs> <laughs> he thought the same thing when he saw that 15, I'm sure. Uh... 
Stay low, stay low, stay low. Stay low. He's gonna hit. Oh, we will too. Fucker hits a natural 20. So I'm trying to hit a 19 again. It's pointless. I'm going to let him walk with it. <clears throat> Fuck! And I don't want to try to hit a 17. I don't think 18 is going to be enough. Fucking. I, I just. I accept the disadvantage. It's garbage. Uh, fucking 15. I see adding this 3 was a mistake now. I know what this hand moves. <sighs> Lucky. Give me a natural, come on. Fuck. Give me a 10. Not what I needed. Fuck. Well, there's no ones out on the board, so... I mean, I guess there's okay odds of me pulling one, but it ain't gonna happen. <laughs> Fucking 10. You played well, and I played well. If you're yeah, ever looking for... I think I need to know. I know what I need to do. You cool, cool. All right. Again. Make sure we get this going. Back again. Yes, I'm back again. Yeah, fucking credits are about to get even lower yet. Yeah, this has got to go. Every time. Give me a ten. Of course, he's got an answer for it. Naturals. Well, you don't need 15, don't be 19. You're fucking 20, will you? situation. Mm -hmm. You played well and I'm 
Now we're down. Excellent. position before he's even under 10. Yeah, and there it is. You played well in our last- I'm not gonna accept being down too. If right? you're it's ever just, looking- it's, it's no matter what you do to your fucking deck, it just doesn't seem to fucking matter. You face the same kind of bullshit both ways if you don't draw some fucking good shit. I mean, unless you got a deck full of nothing but plus negatives. Back again. Work. Excellent. Hi. I loaded, right? You played well in the fourth set. If you're ever looking for I don't remember if I loaded or not, I ran through that so quick. Back again. Excellent. I replaced that bullshit card, right? That's the choice that needed to be made. It's not a bad draw. I can work with that. I can still work with that. This stays at 19. That's fine. Hmm. I can afford to stay with 18 and try to force him to do something here. There you go. Stay low. Stay low, 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 low. God damn you. Well, in our life, excellent. Kind of a rough draw. Because it's shit like that. It gives him a natural lead. Mm. Stay low. Good, it's gonna force the issue on him. That makes up for that last one. 19. 
Oh fuck, I screwed myself. Ooh, did I get lucky there. Wow, did I get lucky. Continuing to get lucky. And look at the time. Might pay for that fucking mistake. Played well and I went. We're even. Excellent. I. I'm not even going to bother. This fucking prick. Sucker. I don't believe it. You did well in our last match. I don't know where we're at. So if you're ever stop. looking for him, we're up one. Give it a couple more a couple more whirls. Back again. Smoke again, and then we'll get on with the Excellent. game. I'm just trying to build up some credits here. It's been kind of a grind with this shit. But if anyone's looking, you know, to figure out their POSIX strategy, I mean, learn along with me. Oh, let's see here. I'll try to draw. Anything over a nine, I'm fucked. It's a nine or yeah, whatever, we'll end it here. Yeah, I had a feeling he'd pull that. Let him take that first one like that. Give me a natural. I'll take that. And now I'm up against the ropes. Okay. Come on, give me 20, baby. Fuck. <sighs> Stays with 18. It stays with 18 again. And 9. 
You did well in our last match. Excellent. So we're up one. Ten fucks me. <laughs> I said it, didn't I? Nine or ten fucks me. Now we're in a little bit of trouble here. Don't you dare. Fuck you! Oh, I saw that coming. Now I'm in a lot of bit of trouble. Quick. On the wrong end of that 16. Quickly, this game is turned around. Now I have the slight advantage. It ain't much. This thing was 17. I got you. Up two games. You did well in our last. Excellent. do that son of a bitch oh see that's why i need to pay attention when i'm doing i hit the wrong button it's gonna cost me my winning streak because yeah oh, well, he didn't have a five waiting usually he's got a five waiting i need a natural to get lucky here to make up for that fucking loss rather that mistake mm. don't give me 25 don't give me 25 I need a natural come on Not good. Not one fucking mistake, too. You played well in our life. Now we're even. Excellent. I pulled a natural. It's nice when that rarely happens for me. Of course, he does. A 15 and a fucking 25 sets him up perfectly.
Stay low. So this is one of the rare occasions where now he can bust first. He gets a fucking 19. Fuck him. Come on, baby, set me up with a 15. Give me a 9. 8. I need that 8. Natural be nice. That works too. Fucker! Oh, now we gotta play and give him that house edge if I can bust first. Here it comes. Fuck, I can't hit that. Give me a 19. Fuck. There. Fuck. This is such horse shit. <laughs> wow. Give it to me. Come on. That'll work. You did well in our last. We're up one. Excellent. Fifteen, sixteens, twenty fours, and twenty fives. They just they set him up. I'm sorry, twenty three instead of the twenty four, but still, you get, you get what I'm saying. <sighs> Fuck, he pulls a natural. You did well in our last mm, match, too. but I think you're excellent. I f mm. Not liking my sideboard much. Days with 18. Set up. Well, I was one card off, but he was still set up. The only thing I'm ready for is 15. The odds of that, wow. Getting lucky here. Damn lucky if you ask me. He 
ain't sitting on that 16 either. 18 is the magic number. Nope. You did well in our last. Now we're gonna play until we lose one. Excellent. I hate to waste this to make a 16. I'll give it to him. I sit and draw low like that all day. Fucking rocking his ass now. You never hear people ask for that in blackjack. There it is. Of course, it sets him up at 24. This might be his game. This might be where we walk away. expect to win every game just more often than not when you put together a good deck and strategy you know shit I say damn keep me low and we're good and of course it fucking busts me to fucking finish me off that's fine though I guess you're gonna go let's go big go big or go home right you played well in our life how dare you accuse me of cheating? It's not my fault you lost. I'm just a good player with a strong deck. Maybe you just need more practice. Or maybe you need to buy some better cards. Go talk to your Rye oh, over there. I've he can sell you some cards to improve your deck. Unless you want to play again right now. I've invested quite a bit in my cards and I pulled more out of you. So. If you want to ask questions. questions, go talk to Zax in the bounty office. He knows everything that's happening on Taurus. I'm just here to play for Zach. So do you want to play or not? If you're ever I'm looking for a there. match and you get tired of posturing in the upper cantina, just come down here and find me. I'll play you anytime. We made a way good there. I mean, overall, I mean, for what I spent on my cards and what I'm currently sitting on, it's an okay day on that. I'll, I'll take that. Yeah, it's definitely cigarette time before we continue here, so.
and you'll quickly find that in any of these RPGs, if there's a way that I can use my brain and like gamble chips, coins, gold, credit out of these NPCs and any of these RPGs, I'm all over it. Uh, people who watch me play Kingdom Come Deliverance uh, back when I used to run that and see me play a lot of dice. I mean, I suppose if I really want to refine my pause game, I should try to do some research into how many cards are in that yellow card deck. How many cards are in that yellow card deck? Um, does it get shuffled every hand, if I can figure that out? And uh, what denominations are each card? I mean, is there an equal amount of everything? Because it appears it goes 1 from ten, one to 10. It's not quite, you know, like when you play blackjack. Of course, you got 1 through 10 in the values there as well. But you have 3 extra face cards, or I should say 4 extra. No, 3 extra face cards to make up for um, extra 10s. And so. card main deck made up of four of each card numbered one through ten so the odds of drawing any given card is roughly the same does it shuffle every hand or does it shuffle I mean because at this rate you can start to count cards and you can start to know the likelihoods of um, what cards may or may not come naturally at this point
Why is the plus negative one so fucking expensive? What a useless fucking card. I mean, I suppose unless you're trying to pull a fucking a one up off a natural draw, it just seems so fucking useless. Scarce amount of those cards too. So it looks like apparently this is one of the few guys, at least early on, that I can 
repeatedly milk for credits, provided the cards fall my way, which... With the deck retooled up, it looks like I should be able to win more often than losing, but god, the losing streaks just seem to come anyway. So, we'll see how that goes in future practice. But for now, let the greed subside a little. This game war is getting out of hand. The Falkers aren't just attacking the hidden Becks anymore. They go after everyone. Kavadumpa kapaliya monapata. Bona nakachu. Yin kin kun no ba mule rachi kun. Tong na bun shanu yang. Kipuna, bona na kichu. Kin ba mule radwana. Tong kin ba no kudnok nek. Kava numpa kum pialia monokata. Ranga kun bis kin no monuat. Kakin chan na guana porkon. Tangabun shan om nang. Wanga kun bis kin ba mula ra. Choni yun tun jiji either duana. Kava vulpa mulji gumana. Shagji kina, lorcha watamwana, kin kun shishi kin, ni kin kun ba mula ra, jikun, wama kun best, ching pala mule, tune rana nu prata, donko searcher domatama, we team and bon rank tong, mule ra on shadfuring um ni patoka wanga chonzi te. I don't even know if I'm any good. I just want credits. Kinkun <laughs> Bogeshapon <laughs> Bona na kachu, kicha badwang, wanga kum kiba bu mule ra, kakin chak nawa gawa bakon, donk kiba nukunek, tonga buk sha um nak nong. Shagji kina lorcha watamwana kin kun shishi kin ni kin kun ban mula rag jikun wama kun best ching pala mule tune rana nu prata donko searcher domatama with him and bon rank thong mule ra on shadfuring um ni patoka wanga chonzi te ika krotu haku jije watu yama kama wuna henak nek Potata, Twanga Chun Tise, Grutu Haga Jijiwa, 
What a juma wana hu wama hulhu na tek. We team member rank thong. Muli ra on shadowing um ni patoka wanga chonzi te. Ika krotu haku jije. Patu yama kama wuna henak neck. By taking a dive. Ka chikun ita haldonga. I just want my credits. I'm taking a dive, I don't get paid. Stimo podona rundi haldonga ku hunkabe. Shagji kina lorcha watamwana king kun shishi king ni king kun ban mula rag ji kun wama kun best ching pala mule tune rana nu prata donko searcha domatama ucha hatunga ya fulke good i didn't sign up for four bana oto mokao dang ya foki chachiska do punta kakaspaka Bano oto. Takum jus tak miki grabul mogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Tolba bank wale oganda naru chuchut. Mogi sha punga bola wana chikne. Mamule slimo poda dada nanga kubis mule rabes. Gigi hakuji locha kin kuna. Mamule rigi kun. I don't give a shit, Twi'lek. Fuck you, pay me. I the how danga wala ganto da naga to chuchu mukiti chokai ti umpikita. We team member rank thong muli ra on shadowing um ni patoka wanga chonzi te. I want free fucking tickets. I want credits now. Atu yama kama wuna henak neck. I said, fuck you, pay me, bitch. Ooh. I should have took a dive. These are good times for bounty hunters. I made a small fortune on the bounty Zax has been paying out. See the price on Bendix Starkiller's head? Too bad no one will collect. Bendix never leaves the safety of that upper city cantina. Interesting. I'll stick with the bounties Davit puts out. They're usually less dangerous than the government-funded contracts. I saw Calo Nord in the tap room. He's a legend in this business. I wonder if he'd give me an autograph. These are good times for bounties. Kukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukukuk
Not the price for all bounties. Ah, 
Tolkien giusta clicca e grammi il mogo. Tolpa da vunque e la gando da naga ciucciut. Moga shambumpa, voglia wanna cicni. Va muslim oppo da na wanga kumbis, mulli rabis. Tolpa da vunque e la gando da naga ciucciut. Tawa na buta, a wiyat ta gua kanki dora. Chilo mula bini bobo, wonga kumbis kang, ba mule ra. Tonga ito anji che yo malikpa, agin kotu, tonga buk sha unne nom. Kava vopa mulji, kuma nabak mule ra. Chune yon tun ji che, aita duana. Kava vopa mulji, kuma na. Selvin, huh? Urana tu la boda ya mi jusa. Ayo no pis tu la ji yo kaku. I can't see anything wrong with getting rid of people like that, as long as we don't end up on the list of their victims. Tu mi rana no prata tu kyo sercha toma toma. Kawa vui pa mirji kumana kin kon shashi kin. Ne ken kol no va mule ra je kun Wa ma kun bes chinta ya mule To ne ra na no pwa ta dun ko Ok, I don't know about Davik's special contracts Justice is one thing But doing a crime lord's dirty work is something else Ta chi chun ni ta ho kun ra 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 I took out him as well. I just collected on these three, man. You're a slow hut. I mean, are you gonna re add the bounties? No. Government bounty on a woman named Sel. She's a known assassin. No one knows leads as to where she's hiding. I know where Bendak is. Oh, <laughs> Kaki chun nai ta ho dunga Tau kum jus tak mi ke grabi moga Tur pa da vu kwe ya gando da naga chuchut Moga sham plung pa Bo ya wa na chik ni Ba mul slim mo po da na wanga kumbis Muli ra ves Ki po na Po na na kacho U kim ba muli ra tua na Kawupa botenya go jojo piti Kawa dumpa kulpa hiya mokata Wanga kumbis kingba mulera Ka kincha na kokba kon Kawa dumpa kulpa hiya botenya Tunira manu prata dunkyo Sercha doma doma Kawa wipa mulji kumana Kinkon shashi king Ne ken kol no va mule ra je kun Wa ma kun bes chinta ya mule To ne ra na no pwa ta dun ko To ne ra na no pra ta dun ko Se cha do ma to ma Ta la lo e pa mule je kuma na Kin kon sha si ken Ne ken kol no va mule ra je kun Wanda kumbes, cinta ya mule, tonera nano pwata dun konji yo kakol mule ra. Kien konjo pesha, nova mule raji, 
I'll stick with the bounties David puts out. I heard Davik's hired a Mandalorian mercenary to work for him. I didn't know there were any of them left after the Mandalore Wars. I go with this again. I told you to leave me alone. So give me some space, bug eye. Your breath smells like bantha poodoo. Who you call a little girl, Chuba Face? Just a sec, boys. Sawbar, a little help here? I need you to rip the legs off some insects. Oh, look, a bot. <laughs> Join, join the list of band bots. Quit complaining. You can finish eating later. Besides, you need the exercise, so get over here. You got a problem with me? Then you got a problem with Big Z. So unless you want to take on my furry friend, I suggest you greenies hop on out of here. What is it with you two? Say, I don't recognize you and I know pretty much everyone in the lower city. You must be new down here. I guess that makes me and Big Z your official welcoming committee. It's not that strange. Most aliens can speak basic, they just prefer to use their own language. But I grew up here on Terra, so I just sort of got used to speaking the native tongue. You showed a lot of guts dealing with those Valkyrs, kid. You got a name? My name's Mission Veo, and this big Wookiee is my best friend Zalbar. I'd offer to give you a tour, but the streets down here aren't safe. But if there's anything else you need... We just kind of fell in together. It ain't easy on your own here in the lower city. Everyone's always looking to push you around. So we noticed. Still, you seem like an odd pair. When I met up with Zalbar, it seemed like a pretty good match. I knew we could look out for each other. With my street smarts and his muscle, we make a great team. Well, you came to the right person. If you want info on Lower Terrace, I'm the one to talk to. Davik, the Lower City Gangs. I even got the scoop on that bounty hunter, Kalo Nord. Davik's part of the Intergalactic Crime Syndicate, but I guess everyone knows that. But I hear he's got a new ship for his smuggling operations, the Ebon Hawk. I don't know much about space travel, but I hear that ship's fast enough to break the Sith blockade. Of course, this is all just secondhand rumor. Where would he keep it, do you know? If Davik does have a ship, he's got it locked up in his estate. Nobody gets in there, except the people working for Davik and the Exchange. 
There's only two gangs worth worrying about here in the lower city. The Black Bulkers and the Hidden Becks. Sometimes Zalbar and I hang out at the Beck base. The Becks are led by Gadden Beck. He's a good guy. Lost his sight in a swoop bike accident a few years ago, but even blind, he's a great leader. Not like that traitor Brezhik. Before he took over the Volkers, he was a hidden Beck. Gadden considered that ungrateful space slug his adopted son. When Gadden went blind, everyone figured he'd step down and appoint Brezhik in his place. But Gadden figured Brezhik wasn't ready yet. He wanted him to wait a few years. But Brezhik was too impatient. He left to join the Volkers, and ever since, He's been waging a war to wipe Gadden and his Becks from the face of terrorists. This gang war in the Lower City is totally the Volkers' fault. They're the ones killing everything that moves out on the streets. It's like they've gone insane. Talonord's one of the most famous bounty hunters in the galaxy. He's killed more people than the Iridian Plague. I've seen him kill people just for trying to talk to him. He hangs around Zack's bounty office, but I don't think he's looking for work there. All the postings there are small time. Way beneath a bounty hunter of his caliber. I figure callow has been hired by Davik to do a special job for the exchange. I'd wager a thousand credits that as soon as the quarantine ends, he'll be getting off this rock. You going? Yeah, this dive is pretty boring. No action around here. Come on, Big Z, let's go. <laughs> Think about something besides your stomach for five minutes? Come on. We'll go see if there's anything good to eat at the Beck base. I wanna talk to the Wookiee. What are they playing? I'm trying to think about. Uchu a penti, tang duama ji, human ak un ikatune, chi ita kanki, chan la kilikon, chi wa ea ita kanki. Chao baso, chi no moli rani. Uba baska duama chi chopa muska, inba ni chalora kun, i yuma batmali au no ish, cha chiska. Topa na oto mo kasa. Patoga yakuli ko kala jiji. Tingkuin ko ka. Tong hitwa na ji sa kat agi ko tune. Chuna muli ra. Tong kpa nong kunek abog. Smilia! Tingkuin ko ka. Patoga yakuli ko kala jiji. Ki muli ra kun kin. Tong hitwa ma agi ko tune. Topa na oto bokasa, pampa ki muli ra kun kin. Chang wa ba chin yo, shang wi cha ma u cha wish u yo. Kin ba no kun nik do cha, patisa, patisa! Ka kin cha na wa ba ka on. Okay then. Huh? What? Oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. My attention was kind of focused on the Twi'lek dancers. Look at them waggle those head tails. I don't normally go for these alien girls, but I've had some bad experiences with my own species lately. Maybe it's time for a change. Know what I mean? You're here about that? I guess Zax must have mentioned me to you at the bounty office. Fair enough. I don't care who takes her out. Just so long as the job gets done, I can't let her get away with what she did. That wench tried to cut me with her vibro blade. Really? Huh. I guess that's it then. A real shame it had to come to this. She was a good-looking gal despite her temper. Ah well. Plenty more ladies out there for me. If you want to collect the bounty, go talk to Zax. I gave him the credits for safekeeping. As far as I'm concerned, my part in this is over. 
I don't want to waste my time answering a bunch of questions. I'm here to have a few drinks, watch the dancing girls, and enjoy myself. I've got to be mentally ready. Davik's got an assignment for me off planet as soon as the quarantine ends. I'm one of his top couriers. Davik's always sending me off planet to deliver and bring back packages. He knows he can trust me to follow my orders to the letter. Plus, I used to be an intergalactic customs agent, so I know all the tricks they use to catch smugglers. That gives me the edge I need on my courier runs. It's not like it's some big secret. It's kind of hard for Davik to keep a low profile when he belongs to a big intergalactic crime syndicate like the Exchange. Davik's ship is the fastest one in the entire quadrant. But even the Ebonhawk can't get off Taurus until the quarantine is lifted. The Sith fleet has the planet surrounded. Any ship leaving orbit without proper access codes will be disintegrated by the Sith auto-targeting laser cannons. And those codes are locked safely away in the military base. Davik's pretty upset about it. His smuggling operation isn't making any money. But even with his underworld connections, he can't get his hands on those codes. Fine by me. That means I get to go back to enjoying the dancing girls. Mucho shaka paga, ye ki kon no ba mulad raki chi chong. Mucho shaka paga, ye ki kon no ba mulad raki chi chong. I can't wait for the big swoop race. I hear the Volkers have a new engine that's gonna break all the records. It's tempting as it is. All right, well, we've got quite a bit of information there in that cantina. But this is a lot there. A bounty. Still don't know where the hell I'm gonna find her. You can't just walk in here. This is the hidden back base. How do I know you're not a Volker spy sent to kill Gad on Thak? A lot of people want to go inside and speak <clears throat> to Gadon. He's a hero of the common folk. But the days of the hidden back's open door policy are gone. Between the Sith conquest and the Volker gang war, Gadon has more enemies than he used to. We're being careful about who we let in now. My loyalty's not for sale. I've been with the Hidden Becks for years, and I'm not going to desert Gadon now just because everyone is turning against him. Well, we do need all the help we can get. And you don't look like you're with the Vulkers or the Sith. Besides, it's not like you can do anything to harm Gadon in the heart of his own base. Not with Zerdra watching his back. Go in and speak to Gadon if you want. Just remember to be on your best behavior. The hidden backs are watching you. Oh, you gonna let me in then? Kun 
Kavadumpa kapalia monapata, bona nakachu, yin kin kun no ba mule rachi kun, tong na bun shanu yang. Hold it right there. Who are you? And what is your business with Gadden? Calm down, Zerdra. Nobody's going to try anything here in the middle of our own base. It would be a suicide mission. You're too trusting, Gadden. Brezhik and his Valkyrs want you dead. <coughs> Anyone we don't know is a potential threat, and it's my job to make sure you're safe. Do you want us to start attacking strangers on sight, Zerdra? Like the Valkyrs do? I will never let it come to that. Now step aside and let them pass. As you wish. You can speak to Gadden if you want, but I've got my eye on you. You try anything and you'll be vaporized before you can say Volker spy. You can speak to Gadden if you want, but I... You'll have to forgive Zerdra. Ever since Brejik and the Volkers began this war against us, she's been a little overzealous in her security duties. And the problems with the Sith haven't helped things. Zerdra seems to forget that I know how to look after myself. Now. How can I help you? A foreign army invades Terrace, declares martial law, and locks down all travel to and from the planet? You damn well bet I have a problem with that. If the Sith ever moved in down here, all the swoop gangs would unite against them. We'd use hit-and-run guerrilla tactics to pick them off. Their casualties would be enormous. Don't fool yourself. The Sith would never commit to that kind of operation. They'd, they'd probably do something much more grand and deadly. But so far, the Sith have stayed out of the Lower City. And our strength is wasted on this stupid gang war. I tried to explain this to Brezhik, but he and his Vulcans won't listen. The escape pods? You know, I heard the Sith have been asking around the Upper City about them as well. But you don't look like you're with the Sith. They might be spies, Gadden. They might be working for the Sith. Calm down, Zerdra. If the Sith thought we knew anything useful, they'd have a battalion of troops kicking down our door. No, I think this offworlder has his own agenda. I suppose I could tell you what I know. It's not like it could do any harm to me or my gang. But it might cause problems for the Vulcas. And that's okay in my book. The Vulcas stripped those pods clean within hours after they landed. It's too bad we didn't get there first, considering what my spies reported the Vulcas found. A female Republic officer named Bastila survived the crash. We Becks don't believe in intergalactic slavery, but the Vulcas aren't so picky. They took a prisoner. <coughs> Normally, the Vulcas would take a captured slave and sell them for a nice profit to Davik, or an off-world slaver. But a Republic officer is no ordinary catch. They still think Bastila is just a Republic officer. That could work to our advantage. Maybe she'll even figure out a way to escape from the Vulcar base on her own. She's too valuable to leave with the Vulcar scum at the base. Brezhik's probably got your Republic friend hidden away somewhere safe until the big swoop race. You'll never find her. I'm afraid your friend has become a pawn in Brezhik's <coughs> game to take over the lower city. He's offered her up as the Vulcan's share of the prize in the annual Swoop Gang race. By putting up such a valuable prize, Brezhik hopes to win the loyalty of some of the smaller gangs. Their numbers will allow him to finally destroy me and my followers. So how do you propose we go about rescuing Bastila then? Well, we can't fight all the gangs. The only hope you have of rescuing Bastila is to somehow win the big season opener of the Swoop race. I might be able to help you with this, if you'd be willing to help us. We both have something to gain here, and much to lose. The swoop race is for the lower city gangs only. I could sponsor you as a rider for the Hiddenbecks this year. If you win the race, you'll win your friend's freedom. But first, you have to do something for me. My mechanics have developed an accelerator for a swoop engine. A bike with the accelerator installed can beat any other swoop out there. But the Vulcars stole the prototype from us. They plan to use it to guarantee a victory in this year's swoop race. I need you to break into their base and steal it back. Getting into the Vulcar base won't be easy. The front doors are locked tight. But I know someone who might be able to get you in the back way. 
Mission Veil. Vale. Mission? Mission? Gaddon, you can't be serious. She's just a kid. How is she supposed to help them with this? Mission's explored every step of every back alley in the lower city. Plus, she knows <clears> the undercity <throat> sewers better than anyone. If anyone can get inside the Vulcan base, it's her. Where can I find Mission now? She left the cantina. She and her Wookiee friend Zalbar are always looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the Undercity, despite the dangers. Your best bet is to look for her in the Undercity. But you'll need some way past the Sith Guard post at the elevator. A simple disguise might have worked on the Upper City Guard, but the security down here is much tougher. You'll need the proper papers to get past it. <coughs> Luckily, my gang ambushed one of the Sith patrols headed down to the Undercity. They never made it, and their security papers fell into my hands. Since we're working together now, I suppose I could give them to you in exchange for your uniforms. With the security papers, you won't need a disguise anyway. I like to be prepared. Eventually, the Sith are going to try to drive us out of the Undercity. Sith disguises might give my people the edge we need in a crucial battle. Good choice. Thanks for the uniforms. You won't need them with these security papers anyway. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Your time would probably be better spent going after the prototype swoop engine the Vulcan stole from us. But I'll answer your questions if I can. I'm very tactful. Are you itching for a fight or something? How dare you? I should kill you where you stand. Calm down, Zedra. I'm not ashamed of what I've become. As you can see, I lost my eyes in a swoop racing crash. I rely on these artificial replacements to see now. But my blindness was not the worst consequence of my accident. My affliction was what eventually led to this war between my Bex and the Vulcans. When I lost my sight in the swoop bike accident, everyone assumed I would step down as leader of the hidden Bex and let Brezhik my most trusted follower take over. But with my <coughs> implants, I can still see well enough to lead this gang. And I knew Brezhik wasn't ready to take over yet. Unfortunately, Brezhik didn't agree with me. In a rage, he left to join our arch rivals, the Black Vulcans. A lot of the younger gang members followed him. And soon, he and his followers had taken control of the Vulcan gang. Brezhik is a proud man. My decision was a public humiliation for him. Maybe if I had stepped down, this gang war could have been avoided. Don't fool yourself, Gadden. Brezhik wants to control the lower city gangs. If you'd stepped down, he'd have led the Bex against the Vulcans. He wanted this war, one way or another. <sighs> I know your rights, Erdra. Brezhik won't rest until I am dead and the Bex are no more. But it's hard to accept <coughs> the truth of his betrayal. Your time would... Not while the Sith quarantine is in place. Even the fastest smuggler ships can't break the blockade of the fleet surrounding the planet without the proper launch codes. Any ship leaving the terrace atmosphere without the proper codes would be instantly disintegrated by blaster cannons fired by the Sith fleet's... I've heard about that. Feel free to come back anytime. We're not like those Vulcan savages. Strangers are welcome in the Beck base. Oh, welcome. No problem. Didn't work. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. No problem. 
Didn't work. <clears throat> Didn't work. No problem. Didn't work. Trouble, I guess. You guys are behind with your payments. What do you, uh, you think just because you're in some gang, you don't have to give Davik his cut? Uh. Ah, so you want to play this the hard way. Okay. Don't you put up? Rana no prata don't know, Sarcha. It's you a penki. What on a woman mulera? Can't you do a shag? No bully mulera, Johnny Tun. Turji chiwi ita do bola una dicek bala mure slimo wanga kun bischeng takes one man lorry and they fucking hand the money now get out of here too bad i was looking forward to cracking some heads maybe next time candrus i better get this over to davik i'll call you if anyone else gets behind on their payments second chance to talk Make sure I save the skills. Who knows what I'm walking into? Those Valkers are dumber than a chorus and granite slug. They actually think being in that pathetic little gang of theirs makes them important. Gadon keeps his hidden Bex in line, but Brezik's getting dreams of grandeur. If Davik's smart, he'll slap that young punk back down. I'm someone you don't want to get on the bad side of. And I'm not one for small talk. I don't have time to stick around here anyway. Davik's got me working on a special assignment. More apartments? Don't mind if I do. Gee, we 
There's a bounty on your little green heads. I'm here to collect. That's the plan. Fucking badass. Blaster, don't you? I don't know, I'm not sure what to do with the car here. That's not bad for a soldier, I think. Two weapon fight, huh? So you got dual blasters then? I think I'm gonna go with 
toughness. It was an easy way to switch back and forth. That hurt, I bet. <laughs> Very quickly. There are more black Valkyries. Oh boy. This could be bad. Disable it for recovering it, right? Hmm. Well, now we know, I guess. Corpses.
Nobody's busting in here, huh? What is the name of your pet? Dude has a pet? I mean... Can I trial and error this? Let's go with hyperdrive. My uncle. Alderaan. Definitely have to take a look at all these things if I get a chance to. So I'm trying to finish clearing out some of this stuff before I head back. No problem. Got it. Oh shit. Stop right there, or I'll give you a blaster shot right between the eyes. Now, what are you doing here? You're a fool if you think you can collect the price on my head. Now you'll see why I'm the most dangerous assassin on Taris. That worked out well. Six fucking credits, that's it. All of a gang member you are. Well, that was an easy little clear out, and I got a bounty for my trouble. Head back to the cantina, eh? Is there something more on this map? To
gang of a bunch of suck asses. Oh, yay, leveling up. Joy. Fucking hey, man. I've really about had it with this fucking cloud. Yes, what's on your mind? I thought I said I don't want to talk about it anymore. Cute. Nice to know you're so full of concern. Well, I guess it wouldn't hurt, though. I, I, I don't know why you're so interested. When I think of all the men who betrayed us, the one that stands out above all of them is the one that I respect the most, Saul. With good reason. Admiral Saul Carath is the commander of the entire Sith fleet. He's half the reason Malak has done so well in the war. Saul was my commanding officer back when the Mandalorian Wars first began. He taught me everything about being a soldier. And I looked up to him. Saul approached me before he left. He talked to me about how the Republic was on the losing side and about how I should start thinking of my survival. I know now that he was trying to recruit me into the Sith, but I couldn't have conceived of it back then. I, I argued with him and he got angry and he left. I never saw him again. Saul was my mentor. He led us to so many victories against the Mandalorians. Even when things looked to be at their worst, I just I couldn't conceive of it. He, he couldn't be serious. I was wrong, of course. He not only left us for the Sith, he, he gave them the codes to bypass our scanners. I remember waking up as the first of the Sith bombers snuck past our defenses and began destroying half of our dock ships. I knew right away what had happened. I mean, I could have stopped it. Right? I could have stopped it all. Don't even start with that. I don't feel sorry for myself. I feel angry at Saul and all those others. It's all I can think about sometimes. No, I fought Saul for years now, and if I ever <laughs> catch up to him, he will regret what he's done. He will regret it. 
No, no, it's not. But I don't want to talk about it right now. Let's go. You know, it would all be a lot easier if you just get it the fuck out and be done with it. Um, a lot of shit going on here. What is this place? Before I go marching up on it. To Undercity. That explains it. I'm in no hurry to go quite there yet. I've still got some other shit I'd like to take care of before I go busting down there. I think I've done enough combat to get ready for my next fight in the uh, in the ring. Plus, I got a bounty to turn in at the can at the uh, cantina. So. I have to break into the base. Too. Oh, there's so much shit I gotta do. I don't take 300 credits for any fucking bounties. Pay me like you pay a Mandalorian and give me four. These are good times for bounty hunters. Of course, her and her Wookiee friend is no longer here. Ugh, so much shit I gotta do. Damn it. Oh, temptations of motherfucker. Uh, let's see if I can squeeze some more credits Back out of again. Gary. Excellent. Hi. Fucking draws a natural. Get the fuck out of here. What a bunch of fucking bullshit that is, huh? Screwed. Um. 
a fucking natural so I'm quit dealing with this dumb shit. Oh, give him one. Sure, like he needs it. Ugh. Fucking asshole. You played well in our last. Back down one. Nice. saying a stay, save early and save often is a good thing, right? Because I think the game just crashed. Oh no, the game didn't crash. We have an update coming. So with that being said, I'm going to quick finish this game of Pazak and we're going to end the broadcast here briefly because this is going to cut me off and we're going to do the update and be back later. So, uh,